Hey, I thanks aloud for meaning of life on Taco Tuesday. Two essays, two affirmations, text loop. I don't know, but I enjoy tacos a lot, so that's good enough for me. I really enjoy tacos, so this is definitely a good thing. I am glad that I can enjoy food like this and not feel bad about it. Tacos are a very versatile dish, so they can be enjoyed in many ways. The flavors in the tacos were very interesting and unique. The chicken was cooked perfectly, so it had a nice crispy texture. I really enjoyed these tacos. The flavor combinations are amazing and they can be eaten in many different ways. The chicken was Unfortunately, a little dry, but overall I thought they were great. I thought the writing was great and I enjoyed reading it. It felt a little dry to me but overall I thought they were great. Very descriptive and I could picture everything vividly. I think this writer has a lot of talent. I found it interesting how they explored different mental states throughout the essay. For instance when she talks about focusing on positivity. Or when she discusses her fear of abandonment. This makes the essay more nuanced and interesting to read. Which is a plus in my book. I found this essay to be very interesting and well written. Cassandra's fear of abandonment is something that a lot of people can relate to. So her writing style makes the essay engaging and easy to read. I think it's great that she. Through her essay is trying to encourage others to express their fears in order to better understand them and hopefully alleviate some of the anxiety that comes with them. In general, I think that this essay is a good way to encourage others to express their fears in order to better understand them and hopefully alleviate some of the anxiety that comes with them. It can be difficult for people not to talk about their especially in the face of social anxiety, but it can be really helpful to do so. Additionally, I think that this essay is a good example of how writing about one's fears can help them process and understand those fears more deeply. I think that it's really helpful to write about one's thoughts and feelings in the face of social anxiety. It allows us to process and understand our fears more deeply, which can often lead to decreasing those fears over time. Additionally, I myself Find it helpful to document my progress and how I'm feeling in order to provide others who are struggling with social anxiety with an example of what they too can achieve. I found it helpful to document my progress and how I'm feeling in order to provide others who are struggling with social anxiety with an example of what they too can achieve. It was also reassuring for myself to see that I had made some improvements. Even if there were still areas in which I needed to work. I am grateful for the progress I have made. I am grateful for all the good things in my life, and I am grateful for the friends that I have and for all of the lessons that they've taught me. I have come to appreciate life more, and the simple things that make it worth living. I am proud of all the hard work that I've put in over the years. I am grateful for all the good that has come my way. I enjoy spending time with loved ones, and find happiness in simple things. I am constantly learning and trying to improve myself. I try my best to live according to principle, even when it is tough. Life is full of challenges that I need to face head on in order for me continue growing.